everybody. Welcome to the Hopori Podcast. I'm Toa Narada. I'm Vanu. I'm Rungus. I'm Vashmak. I'm Craig Surprise. And this is episode 11. Sweet. Just need to move so, my uh, microphone away from our. Uh, uh, are you swallowing your microphone right now? Are you what? Eating it? Are you hungry? Are you trying to eat your microphone? I am. <laughs> Proper. Um, yeah, so this podcast is the Brick Fair podcast, and this is going to be really late because Brick Fair would have been like a month ago by the time this is coming out, but that's okay. Um, so let's just clarify who went. Um, it was me and then Banu and Noretta. The three of us went. Yep. Rang and Krex are here to hang out, ask questions, be cool. Um, and this whole podcast is just going to be about um, Brick Fair. Brick Fair. The whole time. There's not, <laughs> not going to be a mock segment or anything like that. So, Except yeah. for the mocks that we saw over there. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Excluding some. Yes, that too. <laughs> Bees, like your whatever, what was his name? Buzzbee, whatever. That mock was crazy. But yeah, yeah we so. just included it. Yep. <laughs> like, oh, great. But we're not we're not showing pictures though. I know, no. I know, I know. <laughs> so, uh, Banu, you want to talk? You want to start? We're going to talk about how our points converging and when we met. Banu, you were an exhibitor. You want to talk about that? Uh, spotlight. Yeah. So <laughs> so painful. Uh, yes. Um, okay. So. I'm not going to talk about the drive there, because that's boring. I... First, um... When we got to the hotel, I spent one night already, and I woke up the next morning to see a message from Thatchmack. And he was asking me... Is that me, what you're going to name um, him? No, Thatchmack. You're actually going to call him by his actual... YouTube. Yeah, what else would he call me, Steve? <laughs> oh, yeah. Start calling you Camellio. You no. <laughs> <laughs> Carry on. But he got, he got a message from Thatchmac. Yes, I got a message from Thatchmac um, that morning, uh, very early in the morning, by the way. And he was asking where I was staying so that we could plan a meetup. And he told me which hotel he was staying in, and it just so happened that we were in the same one. So. Yeah. Then and there, we both freaked out. (laughs) Yep, both. And, uh, (laughs) right, like, as soon as I, like, finished sending, like, one or two messages, I immediately went to, like, getting ready and everything. So we could meet downstairs and, I don't know, have breakfast and talk or something. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, I was just kind of, so I got ready very, very quickly. And I ended up downstairs. Who's still half-dressed when he goes, though? (laughs) (laughs) no and he's in his his bathrobe and everything what what i i I don't have one i think oh sure (laughs) buddy anyway i was downstairs and i was just you know waiting and i was just i was dying the 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 build-up and the anticipation was killing me and then Thatch Mac finally shows up. You took really, really long, by the way. Thanks, man. You, you were killing no, I, I just wanted to make you wait for the money, so. Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Um, so, it was just kind of like, it didn't really go as anticipated. Like, it was kind of like a, just a casual talk. We weren't going crazy or anything. We weren't like, <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so actually, crazy to me. Vanu, actually, no. Vanu said an awkward tone. Immediately we start talking, and went up, and I said, hey, what's up? He goes, the sky. And I'm like, all right, this is going to be awkward. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's just my way of being friendly, you know, when you shoot I down his, my I shook your hand, right? I don't remember that. I think I shook your hand. Yeah. Is that how you actually yeah. greet people? You shake people's arms? Yeah. <laughs> Bro. It's we, formal. We don't. No, no, Rangus, you have it all wrong. We punch each other in the face. Yeah. What? No, we don't do that. We, uh, we embrace a hook. You. No. <laughs> what are you so, saying you about? Anyway. No, not wrong with that. <laughs> yeah, there is Rangus. Uh, stop being so sensitive. Nobody wants a sweaty hug from you, Rangus. <laughs> You're the sweaty one. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. So, you know, it was all casual. Me and Thatch um, shook hands. It was real disgusting, by the way. And I'm joking. So, <laughs> um... 
So we just, we just had a casual talk, and uh, we went and snatched ourselves some uh, some cereal, losers breakfast, <laughs> and uh, and we were just talking about stuff, talking about mo- um, like the mocks that we we're gonna see there, and I think that was the first day that I was actually gonna you know present at Brick Fair for a significant amount of time because the first day was just kind of you know. I decided to show. I decided not to show up at all and just stay at a friend's house because usually when it first starts, it's really, really slow and boring, and I don't like it. So I just waited it out, and so it was real fun meeting up uh, with Thatch that morning. I gave him a chameleon up. head that he went on to lose. So <laughs> yeah, okay. So laugh now, uh, Thatch. I will. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> okay, now don't do it again. How do you manage because... to lose a head? I don't know. He's well, crazy. I lost my mind, so you know, <laughs> pretty easy, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> Go yeah. crazy because you couldn't play Destiny? Uh, I could. Don't lie. Just didn't tell you about it. Yeah, yeah. Alright, then. It, it, it's an addiction, Rankus. You can't get rid of it, man. I oh, know you have got quite a bad addiction. Like, you know, it's not. Mm-hmm. It's not healthy, yeah. is it? It is not, and I'm not sorry. I'm not ashamed. <laughs> I'm not gonna be playing it. At- um. So, <clears throat> first day at Brick Fair. It was really slow, and I. The first thing I did was go to a Lyra and Shadow Gears table, of course. So. Like he, um, so I just kind of was walking around and I was looking at the new mocks. I saw a certain mock that he's been, that Shadow Gear's been teasing Tempest. for a while, but you're not Tempest. gonna. Yeah. yeah, I saw Tempest. I'm not, get, but we're not gonna show you though, <laughs> because we're cruel that way. So, um, he actually recognized me from last year, and we had a little chat, and it was pretty neat. Um. And so I just went around uh, talking to people and um, awkward conversation as you do. Excuse me. You want to <laughs> start something, man? You want to <laughs> go? I'll just I'll jump through the camera right now, oh, man. If you want to go right now, chill too. out, chill out. I will not chill the out. Okay. Yes, you will. Do it. Uh, okay. Chill out. Uh, okay. Chill okay. out. Okay. <laughs> Please. Get to the chopper! Okay. It's time to anyway. chill. <laughs> it's time to take chill, people. What even is this podcast so far? I mean, we just... Well, Vanu, Vanu is poor. sitting around dingling around here, so... Yeah. I... I, I As that, you were saying... Fighting words, but I'll... I'll... I'll get to you later, Batch. You... I'll... I'll fight you later on. I, I think... Maybe, Ooh. probably not. Anyway... <clears throat> <laughs> Excuse me. So, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it was just kind of a very casual day, and I had hardly any of my mocks with me, or I had most of them. Oh, yeah, the best part I had to haul an entire bin of Lego stuff into the building. It was just absolutely awful. I'm sure you're one of the 800 people that has to do it. Yeah. What? It's pretty common at Brick Fair to haul giant bins of Lego in there. That's pretty normal. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. It's not. It's not the fact that it was just you know awkward. It was the fact that it was extremely heavy. Yeah, you're yeah. weakling. <laughs> you want to fight? Legos are heavy. Okay. They are pretty heavy. That's true. You, Rangus, you. I've never heard you. Uh, you've never. You know, get on with the the thing. What if I don't want to? Yeah, I want to hear so, you, you struggling to, to lift some legs. You must! <clears throat> well, if Rangus it will stop distracting. No, you can't blame it on me. <laughs> I will. No. I, I won't be justified, He's but I will. He's distracting you now. Yeah. Exactly. Me. Wise. Anyway. <laughs> um. <laughs> anyway, um. Uh, I I actually got the um, speeder bike before I went, 
So that's pretty neat. There was a Walmart, you know, not too far away from there. Can I quickly, can I quickly ask about Vanu? Yeah. How good is the set? Oh, it has a lot of good techniques. Technic. It has a lot of good technic pieces. I'm still debating if I'm going to get it. It's a great set, Rangus. You should get it. It is. It really is. It's expensive though, but it's. I'd say it's worth the price. Okay. But. <clears throat> <clears throat> anyway um I built the set Shadow Gear also wanted to know what the set was like because he was also debating whether or not he should buy it and you know uh he considered buying it or you know well he already was but Shadow Gear uploads his Brick Fair podcast and it was just really weird dude named Vaughn who kept freaking talking to me the whole time <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's not my fault that you that you can hardly, you know, it's not my fault that you never meet people, you know. Yeah, you said you know, and it's not my fault like three times now. So. You know, you know. You yes, know because I know. You know. Because I know. I know, and we oh, all know. I you know, know and I know. know. Yes, you know, and I know, and we all know. So, know. title of the podcast, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 no! It has to be done now. Oh! It has been said. It must be done. Titles, boys and girl. We might get some better titles. <laughs> On rank, you need to get it now, my dude. Now you need to get the speeder bike. Yeah, my birthday is like in a few days. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> a week. I'll get, get it then. Kubi. All right. So, uh, Banu. Uh, so you. Oh, how get it. Going. Going. Yeah, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna wrap this up because I'm I'm I, I talk too much. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I just then wandered around and hardly talked to anybody. Just looked at all the neat mocks, and of course, I only hung around the Bionicle section because that's the only one interesting to me. So, yeah. After that, I went back to the hotel and decided to, you know, go out somewhere and do something. So yeah. That was uh, my um, set break fair. Well, Narada, I was going to go after Bonnie. Do you want to go after Bonnie now? i got to talk to something wrong about something. Oh, um, okay. I guess I'll go ahead. What? All right, so... Never mind, I guess. I, well, what? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> no, no, you can do it. No, no, it's fine. You should go. I talk, I've been talking this whole time. So. Just make you, up your mind. You can go Please. after... But I'll just go before we change our minds again. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Okay. So I'm starting from the road trip because while on the road, I, w I was uh, talking to you guys and then you guys sent me a picture of you guys together. I'm just like, wait, they're already there and they're at the same hotel. What? <laughs> then I, I just, the hype was intensified and I just couldn't wait to get there. And then once we got there, I, I was at a, a totally different hotel, but of course it was a much better location, right next to the Expo Center. <laughs> yep, right across from it. Yeah. And, Do you know, um, that would be me, I'd be like, I can't yeah. bother walking too far. <laughs> it, it wasn't a bad walk, but um, we got settled in and stuff, and uh, yeah, the Mario Brick Fair, just the lines, oh my word, they were massive. <laughs> yep. They were huge, and that was a line for people who had already paid. So I know, really? but I I saw the line yeah. for people who mm. hadn't paid yet, and it was just like, oh my word, is that the line to get in? And then the person was like, oh no, uh, if you have your tickets, that that's the line you got to get in over there. And I'm like, oh my word, it's still humongous. Yeah, <laughs> I will so say just, this. Yeah. I will say this now. The benefits of being an exhibitor means that you can cut the line and just go in. How do you all feel? <laughs> <laughs> that would feel Sorry. so dirty doing that. Just looking at everyone like... I'm exhibiting. I'm a bigger nerd than you are, so now I get to go in before you do. <laughs> Can I continue? Yes. yes. Yep. <laughs> okay, so, got in line. Let's talk to the guy still. Just, uh... Oh hey, I'm already here. And then um see Thatch walking up, waved him, he waves back, like he didn't know me, took a picture of him, sent it to him, 
Like, hey, I just I was in line. You just passed me. Okay, okay, Wait, hey, what? I, oh, hi. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'll give my opinion. I'll give my point of that interaction when it's my turn. So continue. Fine. <laughs> so we got in, looking around, ended up like meeting up and going over, checking out the bionicle section, all that. So that was fun. Yep. And then, of course, the rest of the days was spent hanging out with all, all the group, just. Goofing off, talking to people. That was pretty cool. Filming a bunch. Yeah. <laughs> Got a so, montage video coming up. Yeah. Actually, you actually should so, include clips mm. from it. Like, uh, yeah. what you recorded in the... Oh, uh, yeah, sure. like... I, uh, I yeah. Sent, you have the clips I sent you still? Like, just pay, playing in the background with no audio. Yeah. That would be cool, yeah. I think. Um, yeah, because th- I don't have any of the other clips. I kind of... Um, put them all together, and they are no longer on my phone, they are on YouTube, and uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so, so... Preparing for merging, but yeah, aside percent. from that. This is gonna be insanity, okay? So, I flew in on a dragon, and, uh, no, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> so, basically, uh, I was there for a while, because I, I went to Washington, D.C. to look around and do sightseeing, and I rode bikes everywhere, and I was so tired. Um, but after I got through all of that, filmed some farm stuff, um, I, when I was walking up to the, I got over to the ex- convention center. I thought, because I knew what Noretta looked like. I thought, I, th- I thought I had an idea, like, oh, I should be able to recognize her, right? And then there was a point when I got, I was look, walking up to line, and she waved at me. I was like, oh, hey, that's Noretta. The thing was, though, Noretta, you're 20, and I thought you'd be a lot taller. <laughs> so, I, so I thought you were just some random like teenage girl like waving at me, and I was like, what? <laughs> and I was like, wait a minute, that's because like she looks way younger than she is so i was really confused but i was like that must be neurotic she took a really weird ugly picture of me um and i looked like you did it but i got in the line or whatever we kind of lost um i saw i thought i saw mgf customs freaking recording stuff we were w- walking up and uh then i saw Narita walking back and she was recording i was like wait are you recording it out she's like yeah i'm like okay oh, oh, okay man. Um, <laughs> so that's gonna be in the montage yeah definitely <laughs> meanwhile manu Still wasn't here. Um, hey, so, hey. so, so yeah. I got like, to take his time ashore. Lots I of waiting to, involved. I got into the convention center, walked around a little bit, got into the bionicle section, saw Noretta, met Noretta, had a little bit of an awkward interaction at first because I didn't know what to say. I literally had no, I didn't know what to talk about. I was like, hey, hi, where's Vanu? Here's a shirt. Here's a picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, the shirts. It was a little awkward, but... As soon as Vanu showed up, everything just kind of got... But we were waiting for him, and he, he came running in. And Noretta kind of, like, like was like, oh, hey. And then I was like, what's going on? Look around. Oh, here's Vanu running in like an idiot. Like, no, no. Stop. Like, I wanted to, like... I wanted penguin to, like, walk. <laughs> I wanted to come, like, right behind you, tap you on one side of the shoulder, and oh, just Oh, yeah, I spoiled that for you. I was just like, oh, yeah, look exactly. at Vanu. And you're just like, oh, man, come on. <laughs> Yep. I still hate you for that, though. <laughs> hey, 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 I was planning on sneaking up on both of you and surprising you, but you guys ruined that, so... <laughs> hey, man, hey, Just kidding, what? back at you. <laughs> Trifecta was unified. Um, we were all together, uh, it was pretty cool, and uh, we started walking around, and I think the first thing we looked at was, was the first thing we looked at Vanu's table? Is that what we did first? I think so. Pretty sure. Yeah. After giving everyone I- shirts and drinks. Yeah. Um, we looked at Vanu's table. What did we do after? I can't remember. Oh, we bought stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, we just went gosh. to the Bionicle parts bin and dug in. <laughs> and, yep, and I... Vanu sit there. Well, Noretta and I just sat there and, like, Vanu had to sit there and walk just as, as Noretta and I went and, like, got a whole bunch of parts and, like, started, like, looking through stuff. And we had to wait there for, like, 30 minutes while we just sat there and doing all that stuff. <laughs> but, hey, whatever. It was, it was, it was Jupiter. It worked out well. We got some good parts and everything. Yes. We made, amazing. like, really good parts all one them. Oh yeah, there was some good all stuff. Gone. There were most of them were gone. Like all the masks were gone because all of the oh yeah, were... all the masks were gone. Still got a few here and there, but yeah, yeah. 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 So if you're good. looking for masks, you got to be an exhibitor because if you're not, then all the exhibitors get them before. Yeah, all the exhibitors get them when they get there. So I'll be <laughs> like, all I'm gonna say is that right. <laughs> <laughs> like all I'm gonna, I'm, all I'm gonna, all I can say now is that next year. I'm going to come extremely early to. I'm going to go extremely early early to Brick Fair, stockpile like on every single mask imaginable, every <laughs> single mask there, and then just do straight up handouts. I'm pretty sure everyone's going to have the same idea as you. Yep. 
Except for the handouts part, they might not do that. I'm surprised that they don't have, like, a tendency rule that be like, oh, if you have, like, you only can carry, like, so many masks and the rest have to be parked. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess, but there is, but you can literally take everything. Oh, oh, speaking of mask handouts... Huh? Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> that <was a> second. <laughs> oh, that was the luckiest thing ever. We'll Ruben, get into that. Ruben. Let's talk about your shirt, Noretta. Let's talk about your crazy shirt. Oh yeah, Every shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Mask a light <laughs> shirt. Can't go wrong with that. Noretta got so many compliments on her shirt; it was crazy. I even got a free bag of Legos because of it. And some dude just gave her a free bag of hearts because he liked her shirt. So. <laughs> That happened. Um, well, that was awesome. <laughs> I, I, I need to say this. It was just kind of like, it was, you know, just slightly awkward and weird. But, um, so this guy, he was just like making sure that nobody got run over at the front of the expo center. So he, uh, I, I kind of just came in and he was like, hey, so, you know, he was making sure that no one just waltzed in and that only the the exhibitors managed to get in. So he was just like, "Hey, uh, are you Lego?" Just <laughs> the ways that I've heard like people say that so many times. You know, just are you Lego? Really? Yeah, just <laughs> I've heard Lego. Pe- I've heard people just you know use the wrong. I don't know term for you know a mockist or something in it and then i was just kind of like yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm lego <laughs> are you lego yes am i am I? The company I, I am the lego have yes. you never heard of me <laughs> <laughs> yes i am the lego that one play that one toy company that sold wooden toys and started selling buildable action figures that saved uh, the entire business. Anyway, I'm getting off topic. Okay. Um So I, yeah, just, hold on. Yeah, Should we just talk about can go ahead. Should we talk about the Shadow Gear interaction that we had? Oh yeah. yeah. Jeez wonder, she likes not better. <laughs> <laughs> I bet this is going to mirror, because we're going to talk about it, and then he's going to talk about it and be like, man, which of these three weirdos came up with that? <laughs> <laughs> well, but, I just filmed the whole thing, so I didn't really say anything. You guys did all the talking. Yeah, so uh, I promised Kasai months ago, months ago, like in February or something. I said, hey, because I was like, hey, if you go to Breck Fair and you meet Shadow, Shadow Girl, you got to bring Kasai and ask him what, what he thinks. And I'm like, okay, I will. I'll do that. And he's like, ask him what he thinks of Camille or whatever. Um, I was like, all right, but it's mainly just Kasai. So I held that promise, and I sure enough, I can only bring a few sets with me, but I brought Kasai and Camilio and Bruchaka with me, and uh, I wa- and I was talking to Vanya. Since Vanya had talked to Shadow Gear, I was like, hey, can you, like, can you, like, introduce me or whatever? And I'm like, can you ask him or something? Because I was really nervous. And, Sh- and Vanya was like, oh, I already told him that you are going to ask him. I'm like, oh, my God. Yeah, it's so- short. <laughs> it's short. You made me bite the freaking bullet. Yep. <laughs> so uh, I was like, all right. So uh, you went up and you're like, hey, so you, so Vanya was like, hey, this is my friend, he had a question for you. And Shadow Gear looked at me like, huh? And I was like, oh, and I was like, oh first off, hey, man, these mocks are awesome, they're so cool. And, uh, and then I was, and I was like, sure I enough. I a bit of a fanboy there. Yep. And I was like, sure enough, uh, hey, you know, what do you, I gotta, can I ask you about a mock or whatever, my friend's mock. So I asked him about Kasai or whatever, he really liked him, and I felt like a jerk because then I was like, hey, would you like to hear your thoughts on another mock? So now I felt like, oh man, I'm wasting his time. So uh, I'm pretty sure he didn't mind. So I, uh, I can't, so he got his thoughts. We have that on our recording. Maybe it'll play during the video. Maybe it'll be on a separate video or a vlog or something. But we that happened. Uh, it's pretty cool. And then, sure enough, as I was talking to him, uh, a fan came up, and that was pretty cool. It was a fan or whatever, and we got to talk to him. Um, and then after that, yeah, we kind of ended, and Shadow Gear went back to his table, and we continued throughout our day. It was pretty cool. So, yeah. What else did we do? Uh, uh, we met TTV. We met TTV. That was, the, that was, yeah, that was that day. That was that day. Um, I was going to say, it seemed like the second day we had a really chill day. The yeah, second day was <laughs> we, we need to talk about the uh, the struggles of, you know, not interrupting them for whatever it was they were doing. Oh, yeah. They everyone were constantly taking- doing stuff, and we just had to keep coming back to our table every yeah. five minutes. <laughs> everyone was taking these giant photos with them. I'm like, man, I don't want to get, like, some giant 
Because no offense, but a lot of those photos end up looking really bad for some reason. Like, because there's so many of them, not everyone's looking. And it, yeah. I was like, you know what? I just need to get a selfie with LJ and I'll be good. Um, so I went over and uh, LJ was giving me all comics. And I was oh, like, yeah. He was autographing them too. Yeah. I was like, hey, you giving out comics? He's like, heck yeah, I'm giving out comics. He gave me a comic. He had one left and it was the first comic of Bionicle. And I got it. <laughs> but. It took some convincing. You didn't want it. You're like, oh, no. no like, uh, yeah, you guys finally convinced me to go up there and get it. <laughs> it was the last one. You didn't want it. But, no, you know, I everyone wanted else it. Was... I'm just, just so timid. <laughs> I mean, seriously, it was the last comic. It was the first comic to be released. The first Bionicle comic to be released. It was being handed out by TTV. And it was the last one. What else could you say? <laughs> no. I'm shy. <laughs> So yeah, so you got a comic that was cool. signed them, really cool. Um, and we talked to Kahi. We had a really good, or John, sorry, John. <laughs> we talked to John. We had a really good conversation with John. That was pretty awesome. But we got some pointers too. That yeah, cool. we're talking about this very podcast. So if you're watching this, John, it's fun talking to you. That was pretty awesome. He was <laughs> it was actually like really great conversation. It wasn't awkward at all. It was really cool. Um, Told him he asked if it was just us three, and was like, "No, there's like a bunch of us." And then he asked who edits it, and I was like, "Well, I edited the first few, and then I got my buddy, and he's been editing a whole bunch of them now." I was talking about you, Rangus. Um, so you got a little shout out, a little cheeky shout out, Rangus. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> and that was pretty cool. Um, he talked about that he's. Uh, wait, we shouldn't talk about that. That might not. That might be private information about their plans for the podcast. Ooh. Um. And, uh, yeah, um, I, I was cool. I went over to talk to, uh, El sorry, I feel like I'm talking too much. Uh, do you guys want to say something? Oh, yeah. Oh, we went over uh -huh. to Moldat Masks. Yeah, um, hold on, I want to talk about my interaction with and LJ. LJ, that okay. was cool because I was like, hey, LJ, I want to introduce myself. And he's like, what? I want to introduce myself. And he's like, oh, hi, I'm like, I'm Thatch Mac. And he's like, oh, Thatch Mac. And then Messinac turns around and he's like, oh, Thatch Mac. And I'm like, okay. Ain't <laughs> <good. laughs> okay. you popular. <laughs> that was cool um i talked to lj a little bit um talking about the podcast or whatever he was pretty cool he was a little busy but uh yeah that was pretty fun um uh then sure enough vanu went on and freaking stole messinac and went in this whole discussion hey, 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 <laughs> we're in a conversation hey, with hey, vanu and never stop hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh you're not wrong and this conversation takes about like five hours <laughs> you're like yeah <laughs> not the end of it <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty cool you're, you're not wrong though i i, I talked was, was it a good discussion in the least was it a good discussion about it yes it was okay it was right. but it. um like during the exhibitor days me and like me and uh lj were just talking way too much like we were just walking around all like we were walking around brick fair the entire time and we you were just LJ? what you and LJ? Yeah. yeah and we were just talking and and then like um i eventually on the last exhibitor day i, I eventually got around to talking to him about destiny because apparently he's played it before anyway so <laughs> 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 yes i had to i had to so um uh like i think on um Actually, I think you and, uh, I think Thatch and Noretta were there um, as well. I basically just ran up to LJ and said, Hey, I don't know who you are, but that LJ Mov looks awesome. <laughs> I don't exactly remember that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you might, you might not have been there, but that, but I did say that, and you just gave me, like, a blank look. He's just, <laughs> like, just like... Really, dude? <laughs> It was funny though. Yeah. Um, we talked to Moldat a little bit. We didn't get to talk to him too much. He was really busy the whole time. He I think like, we kind of bugged him a bit. <laughs> yeah, I feel bad. We kind of did bug him because we kept checking on stuff. But I was able to buy these three awesome masks. That was pretty cool right here. That was pretty awesome. Um, I'll send you, I'll take a picture of them and I'll send it to Rangus. Oh, yeah, wait, I'm, 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 or I'm, you I'm, actually might be able to just find them on DeviantArt. They're there too. Yeah, I'm editing this one. So. I won't send it to Rangus. Um, no. Because you're not editing it, I am. <laughs> I want to see you, though. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm missing out. 
Um, but we talked to we got so I got those masks and Noretta, you got something special from all that. Oh yeah, I got Noretta's mask painted, so that was nice. It's all official now. It doesn't scratch yeah. off as much, right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll cool. paint on you. And it has that special texture stuff that he always has on his masks. Yeah, I, I don't, I have no idea what kind of paint it is. Me either, but it, I want it. <laughs> what, what, what notification was that for? I yeah, have no so idea. Turn your phone off. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most laid back podcast we've had. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, but uh, do you guys, what else happened? Uh, uh, we, oh yeah, we we uh we met the uh the winner for Briconical. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That was pretty cool. Yeah, he had the entire um, he had like a system built uh, Takaro um mini. Uh, yeah. Like he had a he had a like a mini he had a minifig scale um like Takoro. Takoro. And it was really, really, really it was, cool. It was awesome. He went through the whole like functions of it. It was amazing. It was oh cool. yeah, there's so many like little hidden functions. It was um, it was cool. Yeah, was play awesome. features and all. It was an amazing. It was just an amazing like fictional like fan made set. It was just awesome. And it felt official. It was so cool. Yeah, um, he deserved that that win. He deserved the number one spot. Yeah. Um, he it. Yeah. So what else happened? Um. <clears throat> We bought more stuff. <laughs> yeah. Because that's all we've ever done. Like, uh, yeah, we just went back in- to another Lego bin and bought buttloads more of Bionicle pieces. Yep. We have and so Technic pieces. And yep. other pieces. All sorts of pieces. Um, should we talk about what happened after Brick Fair? Yes, we had mm. lunch. We had a little yes, we went, up, we went to Red Robin. Hopori Red Robin. Red Robin. Abani was so unfortunate. He ordered the exact same thing that I did. Yeah. <laughs> well, it, it was had a weird name too that you guys kept making fun of. Bonnie Why was, it made Bonnie so uncomfortable? It was like it was like Clux and something or another. <laughs> Clux and <laughs> fries. And it was. Ah. Uh, it was. Clux and something. I, yeah, it was. Yeah, I think it was like, it might have been Clucks and Fries, I think. Yeah, was, I think that was it. And yeah. it was just, like, was, that was just the cheesiest so, name. Well, I just, that, he was getting all worked up about this name for chicken and chin. He was getting all worked up about it. I was like, dude, chill out. It's just a name. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stand stupidity in any form unless it's me. So, there's that. <laughs> so, That's pretty fun. Then uh, we started talking about what would happen after that. This was a uh, kind of improvised, but we're like, "Hey, should we just what was it? What do we do? Should we bring you home or something, Vanu?" And then I was like, "Oh, hey, we got to stop at Walmart." And I was like, "Oh, hey, for stopping at Walmart, we can yeah, grab a set." Yeah. And then I was like, "Oh man, I want to build that set with you guys." So we and all. Then I practically begged my mom to go because she <laughs> just wanted to go back and relax, and I was just like, "No, please!" <laughs> <laughs> so she ended up letting me go. Yay! Yeah. Cool. And uh, we ended up going back to my hotel, or to Vanu and I's hotel. We sat down in the visitor area, really close to where Vanu and I met. And uh, we uh, we built the green mech dragon together. It was pretty awesome. I did the majority of it. <laughs> yep. Yeah, yeah, you, you did. I just built the minifigures, and I felt so and helpful. And that just yeah. kind of built a couple just, legs in the head. <laughs> built the minifigures, my dude. Like, he was having so much problems with the minifigures. Like, <laughs> you know, it's the cloth, man. <laughs> You put the sensei's head on backwards. Yes, but that was intentional, though. <laughs> and he built stuff wrong. He didn't know how to build the laser pointer thing. He was all having problems with that. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, give me another one. But okay. I, I got to build the head and like the leg and a few legs and the tail. And I to build like the majority of the body and everything like that. So that was pretty cool. Um, mm. And that was a lot of fun. And then we need to separate again. Um, part ways. It was really sad. But we knew that tomorrow we were going to be able to. Ooh, I get the chair back. Uh, <laughs> we were, we were. If we knew that tomorrow we were going to be able to go to Brick Fair again, and tomorrow was pretty cool because one ginormous awesome thing happened then. Yes. Oh boy. So there's this dude whose name is Patrick Biggs. I've been checking it out. His name is Patrick Biggs. Oh, I know him. Yeah, he's a great mockist. He does some amazing mm-hmm. mocks. Yes. 
Yes. The dude got contacted by Lego, and he was given a whole bunch of parts before G two was announced. Was came out and was officially announced. So he got a whole bunch of um, prototype parts, a whole bunch of G two parts before, like six months before they actually came out, and an entire box of trans house, just trans. Yes. So, oh, all right, eagle, rub it in. Go on. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so we were walking up, and we're looking at his mocks, and one of them had the trans house, and I said something like, oh, man, it's just so cool that they're, it's so crazy to see so many trans house in the same place because there's, there's so many at Brick Fair, mm-hmm. right? And sure enough, he kind of, we see him, I see him out of corner my eyes, kind of messing with something. He pulls out his box. Um, he kind of And he just hands you a trans house. He just hands me and Vanu a trans house, and then he hands Noretta one. And, and he just like, what? We got three trans house for free. Absolutely <laughs> free. That was insane, but it was awesome. Yeah, that was yeah. phenomenal. It was amazing. That was like, we were pretty much holding like $150. <laughs> that was insane. We were going berserk. Wow, well, I didn't mean to send that one. Oops, I was trying to send photos. It was pretty crazy. That was a lot. That was insane. Um, that day we were wearing all the Hapori shirts. Yeah. Oh, man, so we were official. Yeah, we, we were official. People started asking us about them. We looked around the convention center. We saw... Um, I actually started start asking about the shirts. And the, and um, yeah. People did. Someone said, what was he doing in Hapori? It's Hapori, my dude. Um, <laughs> yeah, because it was hidden. The... <laughs> did you actually say that? Yeah, um, so uh, that was pretty cool. Um, we, uh, I, uh, I think um, TTD was doing an interview with... What was it? Beyond the Brick or something like that? Those guys? Um, and, uh, they were interviewing them, and they were doing, like, a little thing, and they had big cameras up, and I ran around in the back, there was a <laughs> I hope I was in the video, I'm waiting for them to upload that interview so you can see me running in the background with the peace sign. I just, <laughs> just kind of ran after you laughing. <laughs> <laughs> and I just walked by, like, a completely normal person. <laughs> the normal person that I'm not. <laughs> I hope, I hope you're hiding. I hope, uh, I hope we're in the video when they upload, that'd be amazing. Um, <laughs> Uh, so that was pretty awesome. Um, and we got, we got, we, uh, did for the first time, we went to the, one of the sister bins to get parts and we all grabbed one little, we got, we all put money together, get one $8 cup and we all found pieces to put that in there and all paid for it. Oh yeah, uh, that was cool. And then we just went to the table and sorted them over lunch. Yeah. Yeah. And we did that a second time with even more pieces. And my mom came by and started taking pictures of us. <laughs> yep. That was, uh, that was pretty awesome. Um, and then Vanu found one piece. It was... One of those dish pieces, um, one of one of these pieces in black, um, and he found one and it was like, man, this would be so awesome. He needs it for mock. So then he sent he spent the rest of the time going around looking for another dish piece. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and he justified buying a whole another cup of parts just for one dish piece. Yeah. And a lady even offered, hey, you know, you can just throw that in my bin and I can pay as you can have that one piece. Von was like, no. I'm buying a whole other thing of parts just for another <laughs> dish piece. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, but the um, the the only benefit to this was actually one of the uh, benefits to doing this was that um, tires. I was short. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but I was also short like one dollar, and the lady was actually nice enough as to you know make it one dollar off because I'd come by. It, it, because I bought, you know, multiple cups of pieces before, so yeah, yeah. Discount. So Favorite if, you're, discount. if you're watching this, you're pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> um. So that's pretty much all that happened. Um. We oh. we did we did a birthday video for Kasai. Oh yeah, that was pretty awesome. That wish with Shadow Gear. I felt so bad. Um. I felt so bad asking Shadow Gear for that, but or Vaughn who did, but I felt so bad that he had to do something else with us, but it was pretty cool. Um, yeah, I... <laughs> no, he, he was happy to do it. I mean, that was awesome. Yeah. Chill. Chill, chill dude. Yeah, Just despite that, I felt bad because I had been bugging him throughout the Exhibitor days, and then <laughs> you two came along. And then it, was just, it just got worse. Yeah. <laughs> um, but hey, you know... Uh, that was cool, and uh, yeah, so Brick Fair was pretty fun. It was awesome. I mean, it was time of our life. I don't know. I, I, it was time of my life. It was one of the best moments of my whole life. It was so cool hanging out with you guys. It was. And at the end, a big group hug. Yep, big group hug. <laughs> yeah, I... <On> it. <laughs> oh, you liked it. I was. Oh. 
It was uh, Barney it was really incredible because he was getting emotional. Well. Okay, so it was an awkward group hug. Yeah, it was. It was. It was because we had sad. to practically drag Vonu into it. Yeah, it was. It was really sad to leave you guys. Like that sucks. Yeah, like yeah, the really first several you days afterwards. Oh my word, it's just so hard. What are you <laughs> talking about? Really I sad. I wanted to get away from you guys since the since you the started playing I Destiny after <laughs> right after you left. You out, of depression. <laughs> out of depression. Out of depression. Because that's the kind of game that that you have to play when you're like really sad about us. <laughs> yeah. It was I, it was hard to let go, but next year, you know, hopefully it'll be awesome. Looking forward to it. Hopefully it can go. Yeah. Some awesome stuff happened, some weird stuff happened. Some dude gave Nerida his number. That was kinda weird, but yeah. you know, I, I, Oh okay. Okay. I I remember hearing this, but I Ah, uh, oh, okay. <laughs> so he was just helping me find some techniques, and he's, then I started telling him about um, my DeviantArt page and my YouTube, and he's like, oh, you seem pretty chill. Here's my number. We can uh, contact and chat sometime or something. Whoa. I was like, okay, um, right. yeah, thanks. I, I, I love that. I love he decided to do that when Vanu and I weren't there. That's when he decided <laughs> to give you his number, because he but, knew Vanu and I would have gave him a really bad look. If he <laughs> no, 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 no. He did the same thing to me. Right? He gave you his number? No, 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 no. He offered. And I was just like, maybe. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no I was just... I, no, no, I was just like... I was just like... That was... Yeah, that was weird. That, he was nice, but... That was a little weird. Don't just give random people your number. Um, yeah. I, was, I was just like, okay. Uh, uh, when I first... When I heard that, I was just like... Perhaps... Like my voice <laughs> dropped, like so, like the tone of my voice dropped so much to like, it was just like, sure. Yeah, Noretta was definitely <laughs> fan favorite at Brick Fair, that's for sure. Um, <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> you have but, too many fans. You're too popular on DeviantArt. DeviantArt weirdos watching you and everything. Um, I but, wouldn't say they're all weirdos. I, I mean. And Silva Mox, I got to meet him, so that was pretty cool. But... Yeah. The Hapori are weird, therefore everyone Wait. else is. Bio 2 in itself is weird. Well. Yeah. <laughs> um, but, yeah, Brick Fair was incredible. I was so sad to leave you guys. and. Yeah. Um, but oh, it was yeah. awesome. I really enjoyed it. Oh, yeah, and uh, while we were having lunch at Brick Fair, how long I took to eat. Yes. I he just took forever to eat a little tiny. It was like this big. The pizza was like this. It was tiny. little tiny pizza. It, hey, it wasn't that small. It. it was like, it dude, was... just freaking eat your pizza. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I yeah. finished before you, and I'm a slow eater. Well, I'm, I'm a, a slower fan. eater. Like, You're a snail. Exactly. <laughs> I don't want to make a snail now. <laughs> <laughs> you went from being a moth to a snail. Yep, moth snail. Ew, that's gross. Vino, you're, you're, Vino, you're a weird penguin moth snail hybrid. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> I just imagine. That, that, that'll be the title of the video, Vino. <laughs> the, the moth penguin snail hybrid. <laughs> I, like, I imagine, I imagine a penguin, right? With, on a snail's body. Don't imagine it, don't imagine it. You're just gonna give us nightmares, don't you? <laughs> I, I am a nightmare. But, yeah, so anyway, moving on. <laughs> um, that, was, that was Brick Fair. It was incredible. Yeah. Next year, it's going to be awesome, too, because a ton of people are going to be going. Crex is going. <laughs> yep, I'm going. I'm going. Yes. Bonnie's going. I'm a maybe. Renzo, Renzo's probably going. Hopefully, Noretta can go, because, you know, we need someone to get us our free parts. Um... <laughs> and, um and I think Tokoto's definitely going and Kasai's gonna try to go. So a ton of a ton of the Hapori are gonna be going. Rangus, my boy Rangus here lives in in a freaking pit in the ground, so <laughs> he can uh, he can we, it's I don't know if he's ever gonna be able to make it, hopefully one year. But uh yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, I gotta I try. Me. Yeah. But uh yeah, so uh, that was that was Brick Fair. Uh, should we end the podcast, or do we have anything else to say? Yeah, no, I got uh, nothing to say. Uh, I don't know. Brick Fair hype for next year. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Pretty awesome. Yes, and we also hope to see some of you peoples if you uh, 
Yes. You have to be going. Do not be afraid to approach. Guarantee yep, you w- the one year I go, no one goes. <laughs> 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 But don't be afraid. But don't be afraid to talk to us uh, when we. (laughs) Everyone must wear their shirts. Yes, yes, we must. But if we, if if you happen to be going to Brickford, don't be afraid to approach us because we are also losers. We're like we're the biggest losers on the planet. So losers, because you gotta you gotta realize like you're you're gonna be approaching us like oh hey let's talk. We did that to freaking Shadow Gear, so we were in the same place as you. So I mean, it's fine. Just talk. Just don't. Just try your best not to be awkward because that makes us awkward, and everyone's awkward, and the whole situation's awkward. But, <laughs> but we're awkward. But we're People but we're awkward. People keep being awkward. We're awkward, and I'm not too keen on being hypocritical. So anyone can talk to me. Everyone just don't is basically me, just awkward. Don't, yeah, just don't give me your way. number, please. Yeah, just don't, don't give me your number. number. Don't just, go up and don't don't and don't <laughs> wait for everyone else to go away and give one of us your number. That's just weird. Don't do that. <laughs> But, uh, <laughs> yeah. So, uh, that was Brick Fair. Yep. Yep. Uh, Fair in a nutshell. Freaking amazing. Freaking yep. weird. Freaking awkward. But also, but mostly freaking awesome. So it was yep. freaky. Yep. Yes. <laughs> Pretty incredible. So, freaky, uh, like Nidiki. Like, like, oh my goodness. Jesus. <laughs> uh, Vanu has officially lost his mind again. Uh, so, uh, oh goodness! I think we should bring this podcast to a close. Um, yeah. Thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, hopefully, you can see a big fair next year. And goodbye. Like and subscribe. Goodbye. Yeah.